In the book of Zephaniah chapter 3 verse 19, Zephaniah chapter 3 verse 19, the Bible says, Behold, at that time I will undo all that afflict thee, and I will save her that halted, and gather her that was driven out, and I will get them praise and fame in every land where they have been put to shame. I pray for you today. In any way you have been rejected or put to shame, I pray the Lord Almighty will change your story in Jesus' name. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, those that plan to see my shame shall be ashamed in the name of Jesus. Those that plan to see my shame shall be ashamed in the name of Jesus. Those that plan to see my shame shall be ashamed in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's topic is dream about barbing hair. Dream about barbing hair. Did you see yourself barbing your hair in the dream? Or barbing your hair in the salon through the dream world? Or you saw your friend or someone that you know having his hair cut in the dream? We are going to tell you more about this revelation. If you're not subscribed to my channel, kindly subscribe today. Dream about barbing your hair indicates a need to remove certain problems affecting your life. You want to be free from the entanglement of the wicked and live a progressive and successful life. Biblically, the hair represents one's glory. The hair could also symbolize problem, as the case may be, depending on who is barbing your hair in the dream. For example, if someone barbs your hair in the salon through the dream, then it symbolizes your effort to look good and to improve your mental health. On the contrary, if you dream that someone barbs or cuts your hair, it means the enemy is interested in attacking your glory, in blocking the source of your blessings, in removing your virtues. I pray for you today. Every power assigned to put you to shame, every power assigned to attack you with problems, I command them to die. And every evil hand that is cutting your hair in the dream, today I command that evil hand to be exposed and die in Jesus' name. When someone cuts or removes your hair in the dream, spiritually, it means the removal of your glory that brings about difficulty, shame, hatred, and poverty into your life. I pray for you today. Anything that the enemy has taken from you, I pray it shall be restored back to you hundredfold in Jesus' name. The barbing of your hair in the dream signifies that the devil is stealing something from you. Ask God to show you exactly what the enemy is stealing from you or what the enemy has removed from your life and therefore cry out to God to restore you fully. To see your hair being caught in the dream, then the ministry remains the same. It's a symbol of loss of good things in your life. You need to pray for the restoration of that lost thing. For others, baby hair in the dream can portend a symbol of positive changes in their life, a sign of cleansing of obstacles on their path. Also, the barbing of one's hair in the spirit realm, for other people, it might mean the hand of God is removing certain cause, problem, misfortune attached to their life, which will eventually lead to their freedom and prosperity in life. To see someone cutting his or her hair in a dream, then is directly associated with a relief from the issues of life. Dream about someone cutting your hair, it denotes that something bad is coming to your direction. And this also means that whatever you have gathered for long in life is about to scatter or collapse. It could be your wealth or other material things. I pray for you today. Everything that you have gathered in life, your wealth, your blessings, your glory, your ideas, your sources, that the enemy wants to attack, I command them to die in Jesus' name. However, to see someone barbing your hair in a dream, it indicates the help someone is rendering to you in the waking life. But spiritually, the person is exposing you to more problems, to evil attacks, to that help he or she is rendering to you. You need to pray. Hair represents power, wealth, grace, luck, and blessings. Once someone barb your hair in a the dream, then you will lose access to these divine blessings in your life. This dream, however, shows that the enemy has emptied your glory. The enemy has emptied you in life. You need to pray against evil manipulation of your glory and the restoration of your glory. I declare every evil hand that is causing issues in your life shall wither by fire. Every arrow of shame, sorrow, death, and joblessness fired against you shall backfire in Jesus' name. Instruction, embark on three days fasting and prayers from 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. Embark on three days fasting and prayers from 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. Read the following Bible verses. Romans chapter 10 verse 11, Luke chapter 9 verse 26, Revelation chapter 16 verse 15, 
Romans chapter 1 verse 16, Isaiah chapter 54 verse 4, Zephaniah chapter 3 verse 19, and lastly, Job chapter 8 verse 22. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, every power that is barbing my hair in the spirit stream, die in the name of Jesus. Every power that is barbing my hair in the spirit stream, die in the name of Jesus. Every power that is barbing my hair in the spirit stream, die in Jesus' name. Say, Father, cover my nakedness and protect my glory from spiritual attacks in the name of Jesus. Father, cover my nakedness and protect my glory from spiritual attacks in the name of Jesus. Father, cover my nakedness and protect my glory from spiritual attacks in Jesus' name. Say, any power assigned to deceive me with your evil help, die in the name of Jesus. Any power assigned to deceive me with your evil help, die in Jesus' name. Say, glory erases, I am not your candidate. Fall down and die in the name of Jesus. Glory erases, glory killers, glory remover, I am not your candidate. Whatever you have stolen from me, return it and die. Return it and die. Return it and die in Jesus' name. Take this last prayer point. Say, Father, let my glory arise and shine in the name of Jesus. Father, let my glory arise and shine. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, share to your friends and family. Once again, it's Evangelist Joshua from Lagos.